Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Thursday and I hope you guys are having a great day. Today was the day that we visit my uh, grandparents, which I call Mama and Papa. Um, for those of you that don't know, every Thursday my mom and I travel to visit them. It's about an hour from us, but we take that time to go visit them. We uh, have breakfast with them and then we'll take them to run errands if they need to go anywhere or if they want to go to the grocery store. My grandmother loves Dollar Tree, so we actually took her there today. And my mom and I picked out tons of stuff for her to make us a spring slash Easter like centerpiece. So we ended up picking out the box bags. If you guys know what those are, they're the ones that look like a bag, but they're in the shape of like a cardboard box. And um, she's actually going to use those and she's going to take two of the large ones and glue them together. She picked out fly, or we picked out the flowers we wanted, some eggs, some of the mesh tubing. We picked out um, some of the little um, hanging wall decors that have like the, you know, I think it has like four or five pieces together and you can take those apart. We picked up a sign for it and she's just going to make us a beautiful arrangement. I will show you guys when she's finished. But while I was there at the Dollar Tree, and by the way, this is a collective haul, I think. I see a lot of Dollar Tree, but I also see some other stuff. But while I was at, and excuse me, um, here in Georgia, the pollen is like nobody's business. Today, they said it reached a record high and also tomorrow as well. So my allergies are giving me a fit, but we're going to be okay because I bought some of that new allergy and sinus um tablets from the Dollar Tree and I'm going to be taking some because Miss Kansas has a practice tonight so I'm going to be sitting outside and I would have taken them this morning but I forgot so but while I was at that Dollar Tree close to where my grandmother lives I found the sun-kissed cherry limeade and I am so excited about this because I love cherry limeade everything and I did not know this existed but I don't know if you guys know what a sonic is but it's like a drive up type restaurant and they have these speakers and you order your food over the speaker and then um a waiter or waitress brings it out to your car sometimes they're on skates it's like super cute but they serve like chili cheese dogs burgers chicken tenders mozzarella sticks onion rings chili cheese tater tots you know, all kinds of stuff, but they have a slushy there and it's a cherry limeade slushy and it's over shaved ice or what I call the good ice. It's like hospital ice, Zaxby's ice. Amazing. Well, I have one of my aluminum cups that I'm like the hugest fan of. I filled it with ice. It's freezing cold because this is not, and I'm going to pour some right now and we're going to taste it together. I hope it's good because if it is, what I will do is I will sit a cup like this full of ice in my freezer and let it get super cold. And then I will pour this over it out of the refrigerator and then it creates its own ice inside, like a, almost like a slushy type ice. So I'm just going to pour probably about half a cup. And I'm so excited, you guys. I feel like I'm like trying my hardest to like catch my breath because I'm so congested. I feel fine. Like I don't have a headache or anything. My throat's not hurting. It's not scratchy. It's literally just like sneezing, itchy, watery eyes and all the above. So, but there we go. Cheers. It tastes just like the cherry limeade slushy from Sonic, you guys. OMG. I should have gotten more. Because I don't even drink soda like that. But this is a treat. If I drink this, this is going to be my dessert for the day. Because I allow myself one dessert a day. Whether that's a hot chocolate with whipped cream. Whether that's a slice of cake. A bowl of ice cream. A bowl of cereal. A soda. A candy. I allow myself one dessert a day. So, bon appetit. That's really, really good. Excuse me. Guys, if y'all don't remember, or if you do, the other day I, I hauled the Easter gnome that was purple. It's got fuzzies everywhere because I said that's the only kind of, only one I could find. 
Well, we went into the store today by my grandmother's house. They had all of them. But because I only needed these two, I got these two. So they're so cute. Kansas wants you guys to see her melted Chick-fil-A ice cream. <laughs> every Thursday. Okay, every Thursday when I go to my grandparents, I um, bring her back either Chick-fil-A or Taco Bell. Today she chose Chick-fil-A. And I got her the chicken nugget kids meal. But instead, you get to choose your side. I mean, they, guys, Chick-fil-A is amazing. Because it comes with five nuggets, a drink of your choice. Then you get to choose a side. And you can choose from fruit, waffle fries, mac and cheese, I think applesauce. And then you also get to choose a prize. You can choose a toy, a book, or an ice cream. So I'm like, that's the best kids meal ever. But, so she was handing me her ice cream. But I went ahead and picked up the blue and the pink. So now I have this set, you guys. And I'm so excited because, like I always say, every time I talk about these gnomes, our stores did not get the Valentine's gnomes except for one of them. And by the time I got there, they only had one left. So my sweet Bonnie sent me and my mama set. But I was so excited to find the pink and the blue to go with my purple. And I have something on my bed. Okay, and then at the Dollar Tree, um, I found this greenery, and you guys, I love it. This greenery looks so nice. They're just calling it floral garden decor, but you guys, look at this. And once again, I say this every time when I haul this kind of stuff, this is my home to a T. We have this kind of stuff everywhere. Y'all see it on my wall. It's in my kitchen hanging over my sink. It's in Kansas's room. We have stuff like this in the bathrooms. But guys, look how full this is for $1.25. I cannot believe that. These are so much fuller and they feel like better quality than last year. So I did go ahead and pick up two of those. I probably should have picked up more because I love it so much. But I'll start with two. And then I picked up this confetti. Um, it says 0 0.6 ounces. I picked this up for my Easter cards when I mail them out. But the first one is just like little um, bunny. No, the first one is chicks. All different colors, if you can see those. The second one is like little flowers. And then the last one is the little bunnies. But I thought those were super cute. And I'll just put a couple of these inside of each card when I mail them out. Okay, still Dollar Tree. I saw um, Marty over at um, Restored Creations haul these. And I had a fit because they are so beautiful and they look so boho to me. And you guys know I love that style. So when I saw these, I picked two up. Guys, look at these vases. They are iridescent. I don't know if you can really tell on can, um, camera, but they have like a purpley gold, the teal, the blue, all the colors come out in it. So I had to pick up two. It's hard to tell on camera, but guys, these are gorgeous. They are right now they're looking like a rose gold, but here they have all the different colors, but if you, whatever way the light hits it or you turn it, these are gorgeous. And I mean, even if you wanted to, you could like stick these down in here and then have this sitting like on a shelf and just kind of let the greenery like fall. I love it. I love it. I'm so excited that I found them. So I did pick up two of those. And I'm, I'll find somewhere for them. Okay, my next bag is TJ Maxx. And I don't know if I already told you guys this, but I went through Kansas's closet and her shoes and everything, and we went through all of it. And I got rid of so many clothes and stuff, but some of it I took a one, excuse me, some of it I took to Once Upon a Child, and that is a like a resale store, and you can sell your clothes and shoes as long as they're in good condition in certain brands, and they will pay you for them, or they will give you store credit, and you can shop in their store. I chose to take cash. That way, I could go shopping where I wanted to, but now I'm replacing new clothes for Kansas, um, and her dad was like, you can't even tell you took anything out of her closet, but I found her these cute jeggings. They are so stinking adorable, and in, like, spring, I like for her to, like, cuff these at the bottom with a cute pair of sandals and a cute top, 
but these are by um, Tommy Bahama. And wherever they originally were, were $15, but at TJ Maxx, only paid $9.99. I just thought those were super cute. And Kansas is so petite, it is so hard to buy her clothes. But I kept the receipt because I'm going to get her to try those on. And if they don't fit, I can take them back. And my sister is so sweet. She was with my mom and I the day that I bought those. And while I was out in another part of the store, she had actually left and went to Target to run a couple of errands there. And then she, um, we went and picked her up. She parked her car there. We went and picked her up. And then we all went to lunch together. But while she was in there, she is so sweet. And she bought my mom and I a mug just because. And um, this is the one she chose for me. It's by the Threshold Quality and Design two-piece latte mug set. But guys, look how beautiful this is. It says, mother like no other. And it has the beautiful little saucer with the mug. And I just think that is so precious. And this is a bigger mug, so this will be perfect for my hot cocoa or like a warm cup of soup. And I just thought that was so beautiful and so thoughtful of her. Sorry about the crinkling. And then... The other day, my camera cut off again. It keeps doing that, but at least it's not deleting my videos. But we were on this bag, so I'm going to finish it. And then, guys, I'm all called up. I'm all called up. Can you believe it? Can you believe I'm all called up? Because I can't believe it. So, um, this is just, I don't even think there's anything else because I already showed you the stuff I bought from Children's Place in the last video. But when we were leaving, we were in the mall and I had so much stuff. I asked him if I could have a big bag and I just put all my bags in this one. So, but this is from Once Upon a Child, the store I was telling you guys about where you can sell stuff. But look at this huge poppet I got there for Kansas. Guys, look at the size of this thing. It's as big, bigger than my head. It is huge huge but it's like the tie-dye and this was only five dollars and fifty cent there i was like yes so got that for miss kansas and then this shirt she picked out because it has sunflowers on it and she told me mommy that reminds me of you i was like that's so sweet and it just says life is beautiful and it ties in the front and guys this shirt is so stinking soft it is so soft but this was only $2.50, you guys. But isn't that precious? So she picked that one. And then she picked this one that says um, feeling, feeling fine. It's just a little gray tee. And it's soft too. And this one was $2.50 as well. And then she picked this one. That's, it was $3.50, and it is just an Adidas shirt, gray shirt, because when we were at the mall the time before, she got her a new pair of Adidas tennis shoes, and the stripes on the side are iridescent. So she's like, Mommy, that matches those shoes. So she picked that. And what I'm doing is the money that um, I got from Once Upon a Child for selling her clothes, I'm just keeping it in a like a certain part of my wallet and every time she picks out clothes or shoes or anything like that I just pull from her cash that way she's replacing what we sold and then she also picked out not the toys the toys are for me and her dad but she also picked out this poppet keychain it's a unicorn she can hang that on her book bag but look how pretty that is and this was only $2.49 so that's what she picked that day and then we went to Five and Below while we were there, and she picked this for her room, and I was like, that is so stinking cute. Once again, this has us written all over it. This is our home in a box, but you guys, this is a make-your-own hanging terrarium. How adorable. It has everything you need to make this terrarium right there, and it hangs. So, Kansas was like, Mommy, Mommy, look. So, it comes with gravel sand two different colors of sand so it has a teal color gravel a purple and a clear iridescent sand it has clear and purple colorful gemstones and it comes with the terrarium a plant and calming scents it says build your crystal terrarium fill and design your own oasis create your own calming scents oasis so how cool is that and this was only five bucks 
at five and below. I was like, yes, you can get that because that's really cute. In the end, she wanted um, some candy and they had these huge Laffy Taffy Mystery Swirls. It's two flavors and these were four for a dollar, but she only picked up two of them and you could tell she ate part of one and then didn't finish it. I'm just going to throw that one away, but she still has one more new one. And then she also picked a Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. I think this was like 99 cents. So, that was it from Five and Below. And then the last thing in this huge honking bag. There's like an old receipt in there. But the last thing in here is from Academy. And... I'm trying to remember. Oh, they had their fleece pullovers on sale for $9.99. So, she got her a beautiful, like, baby doll pink pullover. And then she got herself this shirt, which was $7.99, but they were 40% off. But it's just a basic white t-shirt. And it's got, like, the glitter outline and then the blue and white tie-dye center. And then... She also got this pink, um, like, soft batting practice ball so she can practice with her dad in the front yard. So, this is just a soft one. This is good for bat training. So, she got that, and that was it. That is the end of all the big uh, pile over here. Andrew's going to be so excited. Um, so, now that means your girl has to get out and find some new stuff to haul. And I want to try to start making some other types of videos, like maybe some cook with me or, um, you know, we'll, we'll see what we can come up with. I might try to get some footage from one of Kansas's games soon. Um, but we hope you guys are doing well. And if you guys would please remember to keep Jay over at Frugal Jay in your prayers. Please pray for her son. Um, you can go over to her channel. She posted a video about the accident that her son was involved in and his, um, how he's doing. And she is actually, um, not at home right now. She is where he is to be by him. She cannot actually be in the room with him, but she is there in spirit and she's able to go to the hospital and, you know, stay up to date on his status and, um, she's staying with her daughter. So if you guys could please keep him, her, and the rest of the family in your prayers, it would mean so much to her. Um, they can use all the prayers that you guys are willing to send up. So, um, until next time, you guys be well and stay blessed. And I said be well because Miss Shelby over at A Chick Plus Three says that. And every time she says that, my heart just smiles because she says it with so much like personality and I love it. And so every time she says it, I just instantly smile. She is so sweet. So if you guys have not, please go check her out. That is Shelby at A Chick Plus Three. So um, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I hope you've seen something that you want to find, added some things to your wish list. If you see this, pick it up. You will not regret it. And until next time, stay blessed, you guys. Bye.